Hey guys, how's it going? We're going to do a review on the Tunafish Lug Locks. I've used them for over two months and I've kind of come to my conclusion about them. Uh, the idea behind these is that you put them on each individual lug and it's supposed to stop the drum from going out of tune. Pieces are made of plastic and they are shaped and made look like a tuna, hence the name tuna fish lug locks. So this is really good if you're a hard hitter. Maybe your drum kit will just go out of tune an awful lot. You'll find that with some cheaper drum kits, but even the more expensive ones, if it has very few lugs for the size of the actual drum, then you'll find that it will go out of tune. So these retail at about 28 euros. Now in the States, that's over $30. Most of the places online that I checked was around 34 to $35. And you kind of have to ask yourself, is it worth the money? My main issue was with a 10 inch rack tom that I had and it was constantly going out of tune. And I'm not talking about halfway through a gig where you have to do a bit of a tweak. I'm talking about I'd set it and then three songs into the set, it was clearly out of tune. The first time I used these, I put it on each individual lug and it worked, it was amazing. And I didn't have to touch it for the full two and a half hour gig, it just stayed in tune. Now putting them on is very easy, but I did come into one problem. Okay, so that's all tuned up and ready to go. One of the problems I have with it is if you put this first one on like that. By luck that just works out perfect there on that side so you don't need to move it. But for instance this one down here, if I put that one on, you had then have to move it even that little bit there to push it into the rim which is going to change the tuning just that little bit. So that's an issue. And the same thing with that one. You have to push it in and it's going to change the tuner. That one's perfect. And that one's perfect. But you get what I mean? So sometimes that was an issue and then other times it wasn't. It's not a deal breaker, but it's definitely something to think about. Now, another thing to think about is it actually staying in place because you're beating a drum and they are literally holding on for dear life on each lug. I didn't really have a huge issue with it. Four out of five times, it was perfect. I didn't lose one of them. Um, other gigs then, I'd see one or two flying up out of the, in the air and landing on the floor. Um, not a huge issue. They do sell uh, elastic bands that you can tie the actual uh, tuna fish lug to the lug um, you can just get an elastic bands and do it but at the same time I don't really have the time before a gig to do that uh, you know setting it up and then put the elastic bands on it's too much but I think that would work in a studio let's talk about aesthetics now you get these in different colors I wouldn't have picked this color out only it was half price so that's what kind of got me to buy these um, Another thing about them that is just across their whole range is it's a quite a big piece of plastic and when you put it on the drum kit it's very visible you know it's there um, I would have liked to see them make it a little bit smaller, something like what Gibraltar have. Uh, they have their own uh, lug locks and they look very neat and tidy. But of course you can pick these up in a different colour, so definitely have a look around. So what's my conclusion? They work. They do what they're supposed to do. They have their ups and downs, but at the same time, it, they're not deal breakers. Um, I think they're a tad bit expensive, but looking around most lug locks, uh, they're, they're around the same price. There's not much of a price difference. Um, if you can pick them up on half price or on a deal, definitely jump at it because it's worth it. It definitely will fix the problem. What I'll do is I'll leave the link down in the description for a couple of lug locks so you can make your own decisions on it and uh, see if they work for you. Guys, thanks a million for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one. Bye bye. Guys, hit me up on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you like what you've seen here today, you can see a lot more videos. Just click on any of them here on the screen.